Fear is gone. Cubans take police stations and Communist Party headquarters. Over the past few months, tension has been building up in Cuba as the Cuban people defy decades of oppression and control by the communist regime, rising up in massive protests that have shaken the island nation under the slogan power and food, and calling for freedom. Thousands of Cubans have taken to the street, defying the fear of repression that has been a constant in their lives for so long. The demonstrations have continued, but this time they have reached a critical point with the takeover of police stations and Communist Party headquarters in several parts of the country. In cities like Santiago de Cuba, the prevailing face of desperation among protesters reflects the deep economic and social crisis gripping the island, where inflation, food shortages, and prolonged blackouts have pushed the patience and dignity of the people to the limit. What started as a cry for basic needs has evolved into a demand for freedom, where Cubans have shown that they have nothing left to lose but the hope for a better future under a regime that has proven incapable of meeting the needs of its people. In a revealing twist, many members of the Communist Party are now in the crosshairs of popular outrage, forced to hide or flee from the anger of those they have oppressed for so long. This fact illustrates the seismic shift taking place in Cuban society, where fear has been replaced by an unbreakable determination to fight for freedom and justice. Despite arrests and repression by authorities, protests continue to gain strength, challenging the official narrative and demanding radical change in the island's political and economic system. The regime's actions, which attempt to discredit protesters as U.S.-based terrorists, only serve to fuel the flames of popular resistance. At this crucial moment in Cuban history, it is evident that communism is losing its grip on the people whose courage and determination to reclaim their freedom are unwavering. The loss of fear has ushered in a new era of hope and change in Cuba, where the voice of the people is finally being heard and respected.